This is the tire ball that I said I would get an instructional video on, and our weather has not been cooperating at all. For it, you will need 12 tires. There's one on the top, one on the bottom, and five in each ring that goes around. We chose the same size or very similar size tires. Um, that way you don't have anything that is lopsided. And I will count up um, how many bolts we used, but I believe he said we used three eighths and they were inch and a half long. And we used one bolt, two washers, and one nut per spot where it is connected. We connected anywhere a tire is touching, it is connected. So you can see here is the inside. We have the bolt, and the nut, and the washer. And then if we come over to the other side of it, you can see the head and the washer. And like I said, we did that in every spot that the tires touch. He said if he remade it, that he would basically do like a plus sign on each of the tires because you have one here, one here, here, and then over here. The top ones are the only ones that have five, the top and the bottom. But there it is. I'll count up and I will include how many bolts and washers and nuts we used. Uh, he did drill a hole in each spot so he kind of figured out about where he wanted one and he drilled a hole. Hole for it to go in and hole for it to come out of. Uh, the spots where it went through like the tread and the wires on the tire were tough for him to do. If you guys have any questions, let me know.